Congratulations to Ferro State University senior quarterback Jason Vanderlund, the 2015 recipient of the Harlan Hill Trophy presented to the Division II Player of the Year. He becomes a two-time winner of the Harlan Hill Trophy, only the fourth player ever to win the award on multiple occasions and the first player in GLIAC history. Jason concludes his Ferro State career with a 37-9 overall record in four years as the Bulldogs' starting quarterback leading the program to 25 straight regular season wins, back-to-back -back LEAC championships, and two straight undefeated regular seasons. Along with his on-field accomplishments as a two-time Harlan Hill Trophy winner, Jason also was the National Scholar Athlete of the Year and a national finalist for the Campbell Trophy. Jason, uh, talk about the, the Harlan Hill Award, what, what, what that means to you. Yeah, it's just a great honor. I mean, coming here freshman year, I never would have thought of winning the Harlan Hill and um, just being able to be in the group of guys that have won it and just being recognized as one of those players is, is a huge honor. Um, Got to give all the thanks to, to God who's been with me this entire time and, and kept me safe and free from injury. And then also just the O-line and, and our entire team. We have such a selfless team and all those guys are out there, you know, working hard every day. And even though I get a lot of the glory, um, all those guys are humble and, and continue to work hard day in and day out. And, and just also giving thanks to the coaching staff who push us every single day um, to get us to where we are right now. And um, unfortunately, it ended soon, um, too soon. But our coaching staff just always try, uh, wanted us to strive for greatness and, and just push us every single day. Talk about uh, those coaches, uh, Coach Nice, when he came in and how the culture of Ferris State football has changed here during your time. Mm -hmm. Our expectations uh, increased tremendously, I think, right off the bat. Uh, we never really thought that we would be a national championship contender. I mean, even a GLIAC contention was kind of out of reach that, that freshman year. You know, we thought it would always be a middle-of-the-pack team. And then uh, Nis came in with his coaching staff and just demanded excellence from us. They, they, they wanted us to win that GLIAC championship, and, and they got us to believe that we could do that. And once you get that belief in your, in your teammates, then, uh, I mean, that goes a long ways. Um, coaching staff can really change the team around really quickly, as you like to see with Harbaugh this year. And Anise did that same exact thing with our team. Came in, changed our mindset, and um, now we're, we're successful and, and championship contender every year. Very few players in the history of Division II football have been two-time finalists, let alone two-time winners of the Harlan Hill Award. Uh, certainly, as you, as you look back over some of the great players in Division II history, what does it mean to, to be ranked among the, uh, some of the best with those guys? Yeah, it's an incredible honor. I mean, it hasn't really even sunk in yet that uh, I'm in this group of guys that have, have won it twice, and uh, I think it'll still take a little while, just like last year when, it, when I got it. I didn't really realize it all until you know a couple months down the road and everybody's taking pictures and whatnot. It, it's just a, it's a phenomenal honor. I, I'm, I'm wonderful and happy to be in this position, and uh, I never would have dreamed of this four years ago, five years ago when I came to college. Uh, I didn't even know what the Harlan Hill Trophy was uh, back in, in my senior year of high school, so to be able to be where I'm at today is just an awesome experience. I know you mentioned it earlier, but uh, you view it more of a, as a team accomplishment, being the type of person you are. Uh, talk about your teammates and, and how they've helped contribute to your success. Yeah, I mean, they've, they've pushed me day in and day out, and it's unbelievable how when you look at our system and how many runs I'll take away from the running back or, you know, take away some plays that we could be passing receivers that none of our receivers running backs ever let it show that they care because they don't. They just want our team to be successful. Everybody's striving towards one goal, and that's, and that's to win. And when you get a whole team that comes together and does that, you know, no matter who's carrying the ball, no matter who's blocking or whoever's doing what, and they all just really want to focus on the wins and losses as opposed to individual stats, that's what's going to make a team successful. And I think that's why we've had a lot of success. So um, I just, I can't be, um, I can never thank them enough for what they've done for me and how much they've supported me this entire time. I know we've talked about your teammates, your coaches, uh, talk about your family and, and certainly how they've uh, impacted your, your career both on and off the field. Yeah, my parents never missed a game my entire life and uh, they're, they're my two biggest fans, even my sisters, they always come to all the games and um, it's just amazing to have that support system out there and I think the best thing that they've always done for me is they've never ever been mad at me. You know, they said, whatever you do, we're going to support you in all that you do, and we won't be mad if you fail. We're just going to be here, and we're going to love you and, and be there with your success. And um, my parents are the best parents in the world. I love them to death, and um, I'm just so happy that I can have that family. You know, I have my football family, and then I have my, my immediate family that always comes and supports me with everything, and um, they're always there, and they're the first people I want to see after the game, and, and I love them to death. So I'm just so grateful to have the support that they give me. What does it mean to go out with some of the, the great honors you've had and certainly with some of the team accomplishments, 25 straight conference wins, back-to-back uh, -back unbeaten regular seasons and GLIAC championships? What does that mean to help uh, really set the stage for Ferro State football in the future? Yeah, I mean, it's going to be a bright future. Uh, we got a lot of good players coming back, especially on defense and on offense. So it's going to be it's cool to have some of those records, especially, you know, 25 straight wins, back-to-back -back undefeated um, GLIAC championships, because those are things you'll remember for the rest of your life, and, and having those rings and being able to talk about that. I mean, the teams before us, they were just very 
average for you know four or five years. It's not like they have um, any milestones or anything that they can look back onto. So to be part of that team and that group that we can come back and say, you know, this is what we accomplished and kind of set the stone, that's going to be um, just an awesome honor and something that we'll never forget. And finally, uh, talk about the support you've received over the years, uh, your five-year career here at Ferris State uh, from the Bulldog Nation, from some of the fans and the alumni. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's been great. Uh, it's gotten better every single year as well. And, and the fan support and the alumni support and coming out for our games and, and showing up uh, just around the facilities and the athletic department, it's, it's gotten better every single year. So um, can't be grateful enough for everything that they've done for us, um, what they've done for this football team, what they've done for this university, and uh, me individually. I've just received so much help. It's, it's a great honor to be part of this university. On behalf of Ferris State University and the Bulldog football program, congratulations again to Bulldog quarterback Jason Vanderlaan, a two-time Harlan Hill Trophy winner. For more on Jason's accomplishments, please visit FerrisStateBulldogs.com.